going on guys on the way to the campus got a uh, pull day tankster Brian uh, my boy Toong and I think Lee's gonna show up again um, yeah as you can see behind me I got a package taking the whole back seat I uh, got lucky that it fit in there but a uh, small little item small little detail but I'm excited to add it to the campus and excited to show you guys um, something that I envisioned in the gym in my gym that I would put together someday so I think it's gonna be cool and I'm excited to show you guys when it's up you go, I go, you stay, I stay, one song to sing. I want to talk about a topic real quick. Um, pretty much tracking your progress, weighing yourself, when, how, um, you know, where to weigh yourself. Um, first off, weight is important when you're cutting or you're bulking, but we'll talk about cutting. But when you're cutting, weight is a, a is a good way. Is important but it, it's you want to look at it as more of a trend a trend um, an indicator of your progress and just making sure you're on in the going going the right direction okay don't let it define your progress don't let it you know bring you up or down when when the scale is fluctuating and uh, yeah just know that your weight's gonna fluctuate on a daily basis and that's very normal Okay, so the best way to track your weight is one, be consistent on on the time of your weigh-ins. I recommend weighing yourself first thing in the morning after going to the bathroom and before having any food or water. And uh, in the best situation, your, your weigh-ins will be you know around the same time if you go to work, school, wake up at the same time. So keep that consistent, okay? And then do that, do that naked, fully nude, no clothes on, and that will keep your weigh-ins as consistent as possible. Okay, and track your weigh yourself every day. Jot it down, um, record it. I, I I record it on my Fitness Pal. I actually use my Withing Scale, and it automatically syncs or sends it to my Fitness Pal, so I track my weight there, and you're able to see the trend on the on on the app, um, and you can switch it from month, week. Um, time frame okay so two would be average it out look at your 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 weekly average your day your weekly averages so at weigh yourself daily and then take the average okay you want to watch that trend because every day your weight's gonna fluctuate based on a lot of different um, variables like uh, digestion water um, time of weigh-in um, so you know one day you're gonna see it up and then you know the next day you can see it down so track the trend okay um, so those are my two points I'm kinda getting lost in thought I'm um, just driving but uh, yeah those are my two points you wanna weigh yourself consistently on a, a, a consistent basis so you wanna weigh yourself first thing in the morning after going to the bathroom naked before having any food or water okay and then take your weigh-ins every day and then second track the trends track the trend okay it's gonna fluctuate every day so record it on, on, on a notepad in your phone whatever it takes okay so don't let your weight dictate you know where you're at in your cut because like I said, it's going to fluctuate, okay? You want to really go by the mirror more than the scale. Use the scale as a tool to track your, your, your progress, but really, all that matters is how you're looking in the mirror and also how your clothes are fitting, okay? Especially with women, um, as a female, your, your, your weight's going to fluctuate a lot more than a male just because you're uh, hormonally more sensitive, so your water 
your water retention your water weight is gonna vary on the daily especially when you're, you're getting close to your period so don't look at your don't look at the scale too much don't let it define your your, your progress and go by the mirror and the how your clothes are fitting more and if you really want to to really track your progress um, uh, more accurately you can go by body measurements you're better off doing that versus the scale okay but still use the scale but don't let it define you guys hope that helped and uh, check in with you guys in a bit all right guys the surprise is up I want to show you what it is you that one. <laughs> you <even> right <laughs> It is a dry erase board where members, where all of us are going to be listing our PRs for squats, deads, and bench. We're just testing out each other's handwriting to um, <laughs> who's looked best to, to have the campus on top. Sonya won. <laughs> Drive, elbows.
What's up guys? Just wanna um, give a shout out to Halo Top Creamery. You guys haven't tried this ice cream? It's delicious. It, it, the macros are really good and it has a good amount of protein. It's four, I remember it's four grams per serving. I think there's four servings in a pint, yeah. And the fat's a little bit lower. Carbs are pretty standard, I guess, for ice cream. Um, but yeah, they sent me out a free, a couple free pints. And I remember my last cut, I was living off this stuff. I mean, it's great because you can have the whole pint and the macros are good. I mean, no one really likes having like one serving of ice cream. You usually want like at least two servings. So, I mean, with this ice cream, you can have the whole pint and the macros are pretty, pretty reasonable, pretty good. Um, they have vanilla, vanilla bean, this lemon one, chocolate. I, I highly recommend trying it. Go to, you can get it over at like, I think Sprouts has it now, um, or Henry's. Is it Sprouts now in town? It's not, it's not Henry's anymore, huh? Everywhere, Sprouts. Yeah, Sprouts. And then you got, you can get it at um, Fresh and Easy. I think that's about it around here. Basically, farmer market. Yeah. So give it a try, guys, and uh, let me know what you think. I'm probably gonna go pick up a couple. I like the vanilla and the lemon. Chocolate's good too. I mean, don't compare it to real ice cream. Compare it to if, if you've had Arctic Zero, the macros are like insane, but it doesn't have that texture of ice cream. It's no, it lacks the creaminess of ice cream, and you get what you, you know, you get, you get the macros. At, get what you pay for pretty much. The macros are really low and it doesn't taste like ice cream. It doesn't have that texture as ice cream, but the Halo Top has the creamy, it's extra creamy and uh, really feels like you're eating regular, you know, macro ice cream. Give it a shot, Halo Top Creamery. Before I go for the day, wrap up this video, I wanna show you the, uh, the board. We filled it in. And it turned out, you know, just perfect. What I what I visioned: um, squat, bench, deadlift in the correct order. And then we filled out, um, or we 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 jotted down our PRs, and uh, we did only the PRs that we have done in here. So um, I haven't tested my my squat or bench one rep max. I I did test my my deadlift, and I did that recently, 500 pounds. And yeah, so it's gonna give a chance, give the, give the members a chance to um, just write down their, their one rep PRs and just be able to be proud of their, their progress and you know just brag a little bit, take pride in their, their training. You can see we got the pink marker, the black marker, theme colors right there, and uh, yeah. I, it, look, it looks perfect. I mean, I don't want it like too clean or I, I don't want it too sloppy. It's just perfect, you know, the writing. I think Tankster and Lee did the mo most of it. And it's a pretty big board. It's the biggest board I found online. It's 48 by 36. And yeah, it's pretty easy to put on and it looks perfect. Again, I wanna thank you guys for all your support, all the comments, sharing the video, liking the video, and uh, yep, so I'm gonna to continue to do my best to upload a video per day.
and if anything, if I don't, if I do five, it's only because I'm, I'm, you know, spending time with the family during the weekend, and there's not much footage to upload fitness related. So please be sure to, you know, continue to like, share, and subscribe, and see you guys tomorrow. You go, I go, you stay, I stay, one song, you sing.